on episode 255 of He Said, She Said Movie Reviews. We take a look at the Amazon Prime series, Daisy Jones and the Six. Welcome to He Said, She Said Movie Reviews. This is the podcast where a happily married couple with similar but different movie tastes take a quick, spoiler-free look at the movie, helping you make the right decision before your next movie. I'm your host, Tim. And I'm April. Amazing. I (laughs) rarely do you see something in your life that you think about for weeks after but I assure you, this is one of them. What, what's your rating on this one, April? My rating, I'm going to give it a five. Wow, five. It, yeah. it was, well, everything. Everything I can think of. Uh, yeah, for me, it was definitely a four and a half, maybe even a five. I mean, this was a phenomenal series. Highly recommend it to, to anybody. Um, the storyline, this follows the rise of, of the rock band Daisy Jones and the Six through the 1970s Los Angeles music scene on their quest for worldwide icon status. Um, the creators were Scott Nows, yeah, Peter, <laughs> and Michael Weber. Stars, Tim? Yeah, this stars... Um, uh, Riley Kehoe, who, if you don't know that, is Elvis's granddaughter, Sam Claffin, uh, Camelia Marone, Suki Waterhouse, Will Harrison, Josh Whitehouse, Sebastian Chacon, Nabia B., Tom Wright, and Timothy Oliphant, and a whole host of others. Yeah. It was rated TVMA. And it was um, 10 episodes, and those, each one of those episodes averaged around 50 minutes. It was, the cast was incredible. Uh, every single person uh, for their role in, in this amazing series was perfectly cast. It was, I, I want to just say, the direction, the dialogue, but it's the story of all these people's lives. Well, yeah, well, this is based just, off of the New York Times bestselling novel, Daisy Jones and the Six. That's true. And it follows, the, 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 the this was about a band, and it's a fictitious band, but some people say this was um, loosely based off of... Um, Fleetwood Mac. I, I don't know if it is or not, <laughs> but it was about how they they fell apart at the top of their their um cur- yeah. their fame. Yeah, and it, in general, it's obviously it's based about music and around music, which you know we enjoyed. But what I enjoyed more, it's about a bunch of people and their growth, how they touch each other, how they support each other. And how they ultimately leave each other. Right. Heavy. Yeah, it's, uh, this is one of, like April said at the start, this is one of those things that will stay with you for a long time afterwards. I mean, we still will look at each other and talk about this show. And um, a love story. I mean, it is. It is a different kind of love story, but it is definitely a love story. Oh, absolutely. You know, there's, there's, you know, it's one of these boy meets girl, girl meets boy. Well, we don't want to spoil it for no, you. So, but we will say we also learn more about the music industry. Yeah. It's, it's and interesting. That was interesting for us. They do do a deep dive into the music industry in the 70s. So, and the music's really good, by oh, the way. It it's, is. it's all original music. So yeah. it's, the soundtrack is, is very There's worth, a rumor, wasn't that, it? That yeah, another, that they're going to yeah. well, that they're going to tour actually yeah. as Daisy Jones and the yeah. Six. So our daughter kept telling us we have to see it. And I was just like, oh, I'm not sure. And when we finally saw it, all I could say was she was right. <laughs> we should have seen it earlier. This, this series is very, very binge worthy. I mean, you, absolutely. I think we sat down and watched it in two nights. Yeah. And let's talk about the production design again. I, I mean, the, the whole, just everything about this movie was, was set in the 70s. Their, right. their they clothes, a, their shoes. The vehicles, the the lifestyle, L.A. In the, in the 60s. Yeah. If, for me, I just. Or 70s, sorry. I felt like I was right there in the middle of it. 
they did such a great job. And it's just oh, everything from the bus, the you know, the, the scenes on the bus when they were traveling to the audiences. You, you just have to see this. It's, it is a movie about friendship growth and love of music. And I thought Riley Kehoe, oh, she's uh, Elvis's amazing. granddaughter, she amazing. did, she did, she was yeah. very good. She did a really, she's a great actress. I really, very believable in the role of Daisy Jones, who was just this, not eccentric, but, but kind of, I would say that. Yeah. Very interesting. And a very strong woman, uh, early on <laughs> in her life. But I look forward to the future with her acting. I hope there's dozens of more, uh, movies that she's going to be a part of because she was amazing. And Sam is one of Hope's favorites. Yeah, she for- chased him through SCAD in Savannah when he was a guest. He was there speaking. I in, can't remember the if story. If you don't know who Sam is, he was in, um, he played a, Big character. Now I'm trying to remember in the in the Hunger Games movies, right? But wasn't he in a? He was also in that sailboat one. Yes, that's the one I think of. Uh, yeah, which was, uh, yeah, very interesting movie too. I can't remember the name of it, but yeah, I really enjoyed him in this. And I, yeah. who knew he could sing? So yeah. And then you know we don't do spoilers here, but you're just going to follow the musical partnership um, that kind of pushed them to the. The top, and then they had their sold out show in Chicago's Soldier Field. And suddenly, I don't, don't well, it, it does actually start the whole series starts yeah. with that scene. So are, eh, it's not really a spoiler. No, but they were done. And it's all about the stories. So enjoy it. And uh, we just wanted to let you know because people have been asking us in the future, you're going to see more uh, in the next several weeks, mini series. We're doing one on documentaries. Y'all have been real patient. We've had a lot of uh, excitement in our in our life the last uh, year, really, and more coming. But we want to thank you for all your support. We just hear from so many of you personally and so many people from out of the (laughs) the country. So thank you. We just, I want everyone to see this. Do yourselves a favor. All right. So this was the Amazon series, Daisy Jones and the Six. April gave this five stars and I gave it four and a half stars. You really need to see this one. Thank you so much. And we will see you soon. But his, his wife, but she was amazing. Now we're done with this. I know, episode. but I keep thinking about. We're saying goodbye right all now. All right. Y'all stay happy, stay healthy. See you at the movies. See you at the movies.